Hey everybody, today we're talking about walking in love. Ephesians chapter 5 verses 1 through 7 says, Therefore be imitators of God as dear children, and walk in love. As Christ also has loved us and given himself for us, an offering and a sacrifice to God for a sweet-smelling aroma. But fornication and all uncleanness or covetousness, let it not even be named among you, as is fitting for saints, neither filthiness, nor foolish talking, nor coarse jesting, which are not fitting, but rather giving thanks. For this you know that no fornicator, unclean person, nor covetous man, who is an idolater, has any inheritance in the kingdom of Christ and God. Let no one deceive you with empty words. For because of these things, the wrath of God comes upon the sons of disobedience. Therefore, do not be partakers with them. Listen, Paul encourages us to walk in love, which includes imitating the love of God gave us through Jesus Christ. Christ's love is self-sacrificing. We need to give thanks for his sacrifice and sacrifice our own lustful desires. Fornication, uncleanness, covetousness, filthiness, foolish talking, and coarse jesting are selfish examples of physical lust that fulfill the desires of the flesh. And they do not imitate God's love at all. Those who truly walk in God's love will receive the inheritance in the kingdom of Christ and God because we are willing to sacrifice our own lustful desires. We will not be deceived, nor will we participate in these selfish actions because we love God and we love his way of living. See, we know that God's wrath will come to those who disobey his way of living. But we love the way he inspires us to live. So remember, Jesus gave us the Holy Spirit to guide us daily to walk in God's love. Thank you for taking the time to listen to the message today. Please feel free to leave any questions or comments. I love each and every one of you. Y'all have a great day full of blessings, and I will see you in the next video.